Literally just spent five minutes trying to figure out how to turn a damn, well, unstuck a damn kid's tab. This is part of the reason why I have headaches. And I, and I think my right ear hearing is off. Like, it's literally been feeling like water is in it. And girl, that is, that's not a good thing. That's not a good thing, girl. I'm 27, ain't no need me losing my hearing now. Um. Cause I'm still gonna play my music loud, but yeah. Okay, yeah, so I just did my fast, y'all. I fasted all the way up to, what's, the, what's the, it's probably one o'clock right now, to be honest. It was supposed to be 12, but my Walmart order did not come in time. So yeah, did my fast. My legs is extra, extra, extra tight because I did do, glutes and legs today okay i did a different workout and trust uh i can tell i don't be using them for real like i just i don't i don't got the megan knees no more i ain't got i ain't had the megan megan knees in years okay so <laughs> we gonna have to get back with you know working on our glutes and our legs because girl i looked in the mirror the other day and this is this gonna be like girl shut up what are you talking about but TMI, but I looked in the mirror the other day and I was just like, girl, my booty is looking real flat, real pancake-like. And I'm just like, uh-uh, no, we can't do that one. So, <laughs> so yeah, um, we gonna do more so glutes and legs this week instead of doing regular cardio. Cardio is fun, I love it, I can't get enough, okay? But we gonna have to work on different areas and um, of course, with the arms and everything. Y'all ignore the, my left arm with the tattoos. Long story, whatever. But this is, it, it, it ain't even beastie. Like, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> it ain't like that yet. So, yeah. And then, look, I tried to, <clears throat> I was going to do a bun again. But I tried to do like a little wash and go. It's crazy because part of my hair be like, oh, yeah, this looking cute. And girl, look, look at the back. What is this? Whatever. Anyway, but yeah, so let me go ahead, eat me something. And I'm so pissed off because it's about what the fifth, probably the fourth, probably the fifth. Um, what is it? What is it called? This right here, tripod. Yeah, tripod that broke. At this point, due to my child, cause she she she's been breaking this stuff down every single time. So I'm gonna have to start hiding my tripods when I get them. I'm gonna start hiding my tripods when I get them because this is insane. I'm tired of buying tripods and every time I buy another one, the price go up. So yeah. And um, so like I said, I got out the shower. I already worked out this morning, put a little perfume on that don't last for shit. I'm starting to feel like this is a fake. Now I know toilets don't last, okay? But this is giving fake because why is this not lasting at all? No, regardless if I put lotion on, oil on, it's not lasting. But yeah, let me go ahead, eat, and then I might come back later today. Might not. I don't know.
told you came up early, y'all. So we're going to have an early spring this year. I knew it. Well, at least I feel to you. We ain't even that much notice, Love that. Yeah. Uh-huh. 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 Yeah. Y'all, it's 11 15. I'm still fasting. I fasted 12. Ooh, I'm itching to eat for one. For two, I got a headache. For three, I know I need to work out, but my thighs still hurt. Um, I want to relax it. I, like, I'm, I'm almost like, I'm, ooh, I'm not trying to think the way I'm thinking right now, but I'm really having a moment where I just want to cut my hair, go low, and get a relax and keep it short. Like, fuck. Like, look, look at my hair. It's not even the way, it, it ain't even really, yeah, it's part of it. Let me stop lying. Part of it is, you know, how it's been looking. And two of fairy knots. I get a lot of fairy knots in my hair. Like, I'm just, I'm so fucking sick. So sick of getting fairy knots in my damn hair. Like, I don't care what I do. <sighs> Fake washing goals and shingling my hair. That shit. Do not last for one and for two. Like I said, I get so many damn furry knots. Like I'm just, I'm very much irritated, y'all. I'm, I'm irritated. I'm having one of them days though. I'm really having one of them days. You know, I ain't feeling it. I'm not feeling it. Then I keep thinking about a lot of shit, bro. Like I'm debating on selling my car and get another one, but that's gonna be a car note. And, you know, of course, like I said, the house situation, I'm just, uh, I'm just feeling overwhelmed. I'm not going to lie to y'all. I'm not going to lie to you today. Um, today. But I need a moment to get out the house. Like, or I need a moment where I can get quiet. And it's like, my mama's supposed to be getting my daughter this weekend. Hopefully she ain't capping because that's, I mean, it's. I'm telling you, when I tell y'all people do not be keeping my child, and, I, and I'm not saying that like I'm one of them parents to be like, yeah, go ahead, go over this girl. I'll be letting her go over everybody's house. I ain't that type of parent. But definitely don't have that village that everybody was talking about growing up. You know what I'm saying? Like, when, my, when I was growing up, we had the village, okay? I don't care what my mom be saying. Like, we was in Texas for a couple of months without her, me and my sister. Me and my older sister with my auntie and her kids. Um, anyway, that's a whole nother story for a whole nother day. But yeah, girl, definitely don't have that village. So I'm with my daughter every day, all day, 24-7. And like I said, I love being a mama. But sometimes I just be needing a moment. Or maybe I need, a, maybe I need to give me some wine. I haven't drank in a minute. I got this big ass bottle of whiskey that I had bought for Thanksgiving last year that I still haven't really touched because the taste of that whiskey is trifling. Like, I ain't gonna lie to you. I tried to make a toddy with it and it still was just, it almost made me gag every time I fucking tried to drink it. But yeah, um, maybe I need to get me some wine. Or I need to go to the smoke shop again and go ahead and get me a blunt. But I like to smoke when I'm not around my daughter. Like, I'm not one of them people that like, that go out to the back and come back in and just be regular. Like, the only time I do that if it's late at night. But yeah, I don't know. We definitely gonna have to take a trip today at Smoke Shop. I might take y'all with me. I'm not a heavy smoker like how I used to be. When I didn't have no kid, baby, I was chiefing. 
I'm not gonna lie to y'all, I was cheaping. I was, girl, I used to smoke every fucking day, every day, every day, in rotation. When I was like 19, 20, yeah. And I had my own place too. Did I have my own place at this? Oh yeah, I did. I had my own place. I, I just, I had to think about it. Cause one time I was so damn high, I thought I was dreaming. <laughs> I thought my motherfucking ass was dreaming. You hear me? But yeah, um, definitely used to be a smoke aholic. Okay, that was when Wiz Khalifa was out. You know what I'm saying? Like, I think everybody was fucking smoking around that time. But yeah, definitely was that girl. But I might have to go ahead and get me a little blunt or two soon because yeah. And plus, I wanna, I wanna, I never smoked and meditated. For one, I wanna meditate, and for two. I want to um, watch like a whole bunch of funny shit. Like I just, I need to be in a better state of mind. Like, I don't know. My depression has been kicking my ass lately. And usually it's not as bad, but I'm telling you like some, some reason, I think another reason too, why I'm kind of sleep feeling depressed because like I said, I'm scared to get in my car. Like with smelling that, um, that gas fumes. And when it was stalling on me uh, last November, I haven't drove my car since that day. When that shit starts stalling, I'm like, oh, hell no. Hell no. Um, Cause I never want to be in a situation where I got to wait for somebody to come pick me the fuck up or I got to get a tow. And then every time my car then stopped on me for real, for real, I literally was always in like an intersection and we're not trying to do that. So I'm just trying to see like, it, it hurt my soul to get my damn car away. I mean, I give my car away, uh, sell my car, and then get a car note. But I'm just trying to debate. I'm going to have to pray on that, too, because I really don't know what I want to do. I can put money in my car to try to get it fixed, or I can literally go ahead and sell it. Like, I'm just, I need a clear understanding of what I should do on that. So, but, yeah, let me get my dog um, from outside. And, yeah, and I sound a little raspy today. My throat hurt. It's just a lot, girl. It's a lot. And I, I don't like to always come to y'all like this. Like, girl, I'm trying to be positive, bitch. But I'm telling you, I don't know. We're going to do something with this hair later, though. Because I'm sick of this. I'm very much sick. Like, I'm not trying to cut my hair off. Not again. <laughs> not again. But it just, being natural is so frustrating. Like, I don't give a fuck what nobody said. This shit is frustrating. Unless you're just walking outside with your hair just... And it's pure natural state with nothing on it, and you don't give a flying noodle, then yeah, yeah, it's frustrating. Like, no, no, we gotta get it together, y'all, for real. I put too much in there. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Girl, that was the Disney logo. It probably didn't look like it, but yeah. Anyway, y'all, today is Thursday. Y'all don't know what's going on with my hair and on my right ear. Keep going in and out, in and out. I don't know. But yeah. I'm in good spirits today. And what's crazy is I finally officially started my period. Now I know some people may be like, girl, why does she keep telling us when she started her damn period? For me, it's, it's helpful. You know, I, I write it down. You know, I write it down. It's helpful for me though. Like when it comes to these mood swings, I just be happy when I'm officially starting my period because that means these mood swings about to be gone in about seven days or less. So yeah, definitely happy for that. Um, I'm drinking on, which I probably put too much powder in here, but I got lemon in here ice lemon and then i got water and then this powder that i'm about to show y'all so i would sent this powder to review on their website but i just want to show y'all anyway so this is the nat uh, oh, natural <laughs> natural vitality calm magnesium supplement it's in the flavor raspberry lemon you're supposed to mix this with your water okay well it says two ounces of warm water and let your drink it Ooh. I ain't even doing it right already. It says start by placing a desired amount of powder into a cup or mug. Add two to three ounces of warm water. 
let your drink fizz. Stir the water until the powder is completely dissolved. Then fill the remaining. Okay, ew. Okay, so I already wasn't doing this. I, I got it yesterday, tried it last night with cold water, did it again with cold water today. And then I think I put too much powder in it because it got a little kickback. So yeah, um, we're gonna try it again later on today. How many times can I drink this daily? We suggest starting out with a half teaspoon and gradually increase into two teaspoon, teaspoons daily. Okay, all right, so we ain't gonna try it again today because I don't wanna overdo it. But we'll try again tomorrow. So this says is um, stress isn't always a bad thing, so don't run from it. Stress can be balanced and transformed. That is why we formulated Natural Vitality Calm, a magnesium, magnesium supplement to help support a balanced mood and a healthy response to stress. Add this delicious raspberry lemon flavored drink mix into your self-care ritual so you can be ready for whatever is next. Fizz, sip, chill, and feel, uh, what is it? Feel power of the calm, whatever, anyway. So yeah, I'm showing y'all this because I've been seeing a lot of things where it says magnesium helps with sleep and y'all know I am a night owl. Even if I'm tired at night, I will not go to sleep. So. We gonna see what this do. You know, I do love ashwagandha when it comes to calming yourself. Cause I'm telling you, ashwagandha literally made me feel like I didn't smoke the least I have of one. Like <laughs> if I take two ashwagandha pills, it makes me feel like I, I smoked at least two, or well, no, a, a half of one. Two ashwagandha uh, pills, the extra strength, half of one. Best calm ever. Haven't had ashwagandha in a minute though. I ain't gonna lie to you. Uh, it's been a couple of months, but yeah. <sighs> Hopefully this is, you know, it does what it's supposed to do. And like I said, if it get me better sleep, that's also a plus plus. So we're gonna try this for a little couple of days. Like I said, just wanted to show y'all. Um, I am, as far as supplements, I'm taking vitamin D. Excuse me. Vitamin D. Uh, what is the, girl, I can't even think of the other one. Primrose Evening Oil. I think I'm saying that right. And then I'm also taking biotin. I'm taking a biotin every other day though because it's 10,000 milligrams. So like I ain't trying to overdo it. Biotin will break you the hell out. It will have you looking the fool. I'm, I'm telling you, like I already got dark spots that come and go, come and go, girl. I, I, like I said, I might go ahead and get that chemical pill with them taxes hey, I ain't gonna lie to you. Um, but yeah. Might get a chemical pill because they just, they not going. I just, like I said, the thing that I'm scared about is my freckles. I don't want my freckles to leave, but, you know. Or I might just keep my dark spots. At this point, hell, they won with me and they won with self, but just, fuck it. But, or if y'all got any re recommendations, like what skincare stuff y'all use for, like, lightening up dark spots. I'm not trying to lighten up my skin. I ain't trying to turn into Michael Jackson or nothing, but, you know, give me good recommendations all right so yeah today i am not fasting i've been fasting hold on let me see girl that regular anyway i've been fasting y'all yeah, always turn when i hear like we'll cause the sound got that you know got that pipe that straight pipe on them i always try to turn i got a good little muffler because i don't know i like looking at the charges and the, and the challenges and i know somebody got a fucking scat over here i've been hearing that motherfucker up in the industry, but anyway, um, yeah, that doesn't make me lose my turn of thought, whatever. Um, yeah, but I've been fasting, I want to say since two weeks ago. It's been like two weeks for me. I've been fasting every morning from the time I get up all the way to 12. That's how we used to do it when I went to church back in the day, hell. So that's, that's how I do mine. I fasted all this week besides today. Like I said, starting my period today, girl, I'm not skipping a meal. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm just not skipping a meal today. I can't. So, I don't know. I'm going to cook when my daughter get up. She ain't up right now. Hopefully, she stay a little sleep a little bit longer. But, um, I plan on either doing spinach and bacon or uh, spinach and cream of wheat. Cream of wheat is the shit. Please try it. Creamy wheat, malto meal, grits, anything like that is good. And then like I said, that's helpful for my gains and protein. Um, I made some pinto beans 
no, not pinto beans. I made some black eyed peas yesterday. I've been in like a black eyed peas kick. Plus it got a lot of protein in it. So yeah, still been working out daily. Um, I wanna get this supplement. Uh, it's called creatine. I've been doing my own little YouTube research on that girl. The gains is gaining, okay? I really, I really want something though that, that'll, you know, turn shit to muscle, okay? Um, let me show you how my body is. It's probably on. I don't know if I'm. I might be a little bit bloated today. Not really. Not really. It's, that's what's crazy. Like on a regular day, I'm bloated, but today I'm I'm actually decent. So this is what my body looking like right now. Okay, yeah, that's yeah, that's the oh, oh, okay. <laughs> I think I lied to myself. So I was fine for a second. Okay, hold on. If I suck it in, there we go. If I let it do what it do, there we go. So I need something for bloating and I need something that's going to help me stack because my, ugh, I'm going to get my dog, yeah. But yeah, so we will be getting creatine. I will be going to, a, I'm either going to go to, yeah, I need to go. I need to go to a physical supplement store because I need somebody to recommend that, rec recommend me something, you know? I can do all the research that I want to, but I really rather go in where the people are actually, you know, they they supposed to be professionals with this shit and have them recommend me something. Hopefully they don't just be like just trying to get me to get the most expensive shit because yeah, no. But and then I also I don't want to get it in in this house. Like I said, I'm claiming the other house, yeah. I'm really, really claiming it, girl. I'm gonna put me in an application for it um, probably next week. Next week or, cause I think you gotta pay for it. I think that, yeah, I think the application you gotta pay for the shit. I don't know. I don't know, we gonna, we gonna put it in soon. We gonna put it in soon. It, it, it's like a two, two way street with that, y'all. I don't know if I said it in the last clip or not, but it's like, I can either break my lease and go there, you know, or I'll go anywhere the fuck else or just finish this lease and then move because my lease ends in August. So technically, I could possibly wait to August, but it's like, do I want to go? Do, do I want to wait to August? Um, and then they've been kind of, they've been getting on my fucking, I ain't even gonna lie to y'all. Like, it's not just the location. It's not just me not having enough room in here. I mean, that's major points to it as to why I want to move. But um, it's the fact these bitches keep acting like they losing my fucking rent. Because I, I mail my rent out um, overnight and everything. I mail it out. And they keep acting, acting real fucking slow. Like one of my months still shows that it's not paid when girl got the proof and everything. And it's just like, do I need to get a lawyer? Do I need my own personal lawyer? And it's like, when they get that deep, bitch, I'm really ready to go. So it's just, it's so many things that's like playing in my head there, y'all. Like, I got a lot of ideas, one in particular that I want to do. But it's like, the way my content is, it's like, clearly it's changing. But the way my content is, I don't know if I get the support on what I want to do. Because it, it ain't nothing to do with hygiene. <laughs> Um, yeah, it's the wellness, but it's, it's not hygiene related. So I don't know. Like, I really don't know what business venture I want to get into this year because I really do. Like last year, I ain't gonna lie. When I got my taxes, what did I spend it on? Girl, I don't think I spent my taxes on nothing that made sense. If not nothing, it was probably a lot of food and like cleaning shit and perfume yeah i bullshit the last year of my taxes so we ain't, we ain't trying to do that this year so like i said and then with my car situation like i said i'm, I'm real I'm, i don't know like i just don't want to be bamboozled again my car by the grace of god i'm telling you is the only reason why it lasted as long as it did because they sold me a pure lemon okay fresh off the market lemon um so yeah, by the grace of God, I'm telling you, the only reason why my car lasted as long as it did, because I got it in 2021, I want to say. Yeah, I got it in 2021. So for the most part, I've been holding up for 
was it 21 wait so 21 22 23 yeah so what three years that's not good enough for me that's not good enough i mean that's longer than any car i didn't had last i ain't even gonna lie like the air went out in it a couple of months after i bought the car because i bought the car on my birthday of 2021 march 13 2021 i was so fucking happy because i like girl my car dream car was the dodge charger so i got my dodge charger i wanted to wrap it pink at first um i had it in my my little gallery and everything i wanted to wrap it pink but i just left it white and you know that's when i was really liking pink so now yep that's another charger so now i'm just kind of like i don't know like i said it's like you when you think about it, it's like a car no then me trying to get another crib and the rent is increased on the other crib other crib but i just gotta know everything gonna work out for me that's that's my natural thoughts of me being worrisome about shit. but oh, we just gonna have to do what it do girl i need to play the lottery um i am an avid lottery player it's been a minute since i played though but when i get back in that mode i'm in it i might as well go to the casino though i ain't even gonna lie to you I ain't gonna spend that much money though, but I, I kind of, I got that itch to either go to the casino or go to, um, bingo. Like, uh, 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 I need something. I need, girl, something gotta give. Something gotta give, cause my life is, is, you know, it's just bigger than what I'm like doing. If you get what I'm saying. Like, don't limit yourself. I'm talking to you, but I'm also talking to myself. Don't limit yourself. Don't limit yourself on things you can do in life. Like, it's so many thoughts that come across my mind. I'm telling you, like, I'm very much a type of woman that I feel like I can do any and everything, you know. So, I, I just need to stop limiting myself. I need to stop being scared about shit I haven't even started so that is my goal for this year for this for these months of coming like i don't know i just i'm i'm gonna have to sit back and like write down ideas and then whatever one that kind of stick out the most to me then we're gonna get into it also was thinking about trying to get into stocks like i just don't i don't know i don't want to pay anybody either though like the last time i paid for some shit, like i remember i was paying i paid about three different people when it came to sports betting groups, I want to say, la yeah, last year. Girl, I won, like, one time. And one of the fucking groups was JD Boys or whatever the fuck. Y'all know what I'm... Y'all probably know what I'm talking about. Somebody gonna know what I'm talking about. JD Boys or uh, whatever. Girl, first of all, it's too many fucking people in that bitch that bet on so many different things. Bitch, you don't know who to follow. You don't know who to follow, bitch. Like, no. And... Like I said, with shit like that, first of all, they getting the money from all the members that's coming in because like $50 a month. Girl, all that bread, bitch, you spending their money. You ain't even touching yours for real. If you lose, it's like, right, I don't give a fuck. Somebody else just subscribed this month. But you know what I'm saying? So it's like, I don't like shit that's just like overly saturated, saturated, overly done. I'm just like to learn some shit on my own. Like, I used to like basketball I, went, I don't know if i say love because i no nah, i did used to love basketball i ain't gonna lie one year yeah yeah i used to go up for the lakers i did <laughs> i remember my mama tried to because she loved lebron i don't know if she do still to this day but she used to love lebron like cavaliers she used to just go up for him or whatever but yeah anyway i don't know i don't know if i'm gonna, I'm gonna get into watching sports like if anything i might if I'm gonna get into the sport, I might watch like baseball. Nah, I don't know about baseball. I don't understand that shit. I really, <laughs> I don't get, I don't get baseball. I don't get, I don't get football. Like I said, the only thing I can understand is basketball. Cause bitch, you just shooting in the hoop. You just going up and down the court and shooting that bitch in the hoop. So we gonna get into something. I'm gonna have to do something y'all. Like I'm trying to push myself to the point where it's like, damn. Well, y'all come back to this shit and be like, damn, Jackie and motherfucker <laughs> level the fuck up. And hell, I'm going to look back at this shit like, I didn't <laughs> level the fuck up. Like, bitch, I'm tired of being in my same. Hey, Cole, thanks for looking at me. You, you, you listening to my TED talk. But yeah, I'm just tired of being the same 
predicament. Okay, like I said, I've been at this house for like seven years now. Girl, I'm ready to go. <laughs> it's lucky seven. Seven is the number. I'm ready to go. I'm ready to get up out of here. Yeah, like I'm ready to get that. I'm ready to get that house. Like I said, I, I'm telling y'all, I got, I gotta get this house. I have to. I don't know what the fuck I do, but I gotta get this house. Like it is so nice. Like the house, the outside of it, the neighborhood is what, what throws me off though. Like that shit throws me the fuck off. It look like if you ever watched Joe's apartment, and every time when he was going down that alley and them people kept on robbing his ass, like <laughs> it's like it's just it's too much going on. Like it's movement around the area, it's alleyways and shit, it's trash all outside, girl. Ugh. I hate shit like that. I ain't gonna lie. Like, I'm one of them people, I just, I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't think anybody should like it. I don't like when neighborhoods just got trash every the fuck where. Like, it's trash on the ground, trash outside the trash can. Like, why is this outside the trash can? Ain't nobody picking this shit up? Um, but yeah, that's that's what bothers me. That's what really, really, really bothers me. And I don't like how close it is to the house to the right of it. Like, it's a big-ass house, two stories, big-ass house, got a basement, uh, three bathrooms, three bedrooms. I'm telling you, like, it's really, really nice, really nice, but like I said, it's the outside. And I ain't really got no yard. I actually like having a yard. I like having to where my lawn is, cu is cut low, you know, I got the little flowers on the, like, I like shit like that, so... I'm just, I'm, I don't know. I don't know what I should do, y'all. Should I continue looking for other houses and not just settle with that one? Or should I just like, you know, go with that one? Because I really like that shower. It's the showers for me. And it's really also like the fact that the master bedroom got the um, bathroom where you can walk out and you right there. And it got a balcony. You got a balcony in the back. I literally can walk out my back door and be on the balcony. Like, that is so cute. I don't know if I'll be out there, but... I think it's nice but yeah um i don't know i don't know i'm in thoughts i'm in my thoughts this morning so yeah let me go ahead and finish this drink and yeah let's see what we got planned today what workout we're gonna do we're probably gonna do cardio today i ain't did cardio in like two or three days i've been doing a lot of arm workouts and of course legs and glutes because my glutes and legs and thighs have been on fire yeah all right y'all so. yeah last thing i'm gonna say today is also gonna be a maintenance day so today i am going to um hopefully that beat in my damn closet is not expired I, when do beat expire y'all girl anyway um i'm gonna get my mustache out i got a mustache coming in baby i'm about to talk like mario in a second with luigi we're gonna be all together we're gonna be a damn trio but yeah, um, mustache is definitely coming the fuck in. Um, so we're gonna get rid of that. Um, I'm gonna get my brows together because my brows is kind of a little crazy. I don't know. I think I want to go a little thinner. I like when my brows thin. It give me that, that you know, some type of look. Some type of look. I can't explain it. Get out of my armpits. We're gonna get my legs because everything is hairy. I have not been shaving, y'all. I have not so yeah we're gonna get everything together and then yeah i got this body on because i got what is this two braids oh girl look at me two braids in because we slapping a wig on we was gonna do the brown wig with the bang it was cute i might still do that i don't know girl i got choices bitch I, girl go in my closet and pick a wig out because i got a couple but yeah um <clears throat> We gonna do the black wig. We gonna do the black curly one. It's just my go-to. And plus, it's it's good for my head. My head is big. And then my braids is big. So, <laughs> I already tried it on yesterday. I washed it, conditioned it. So, now it's just air drying. And yeah, we gonna eventually put the wig on. We gonna put the wig back on, yeah. All right, y'all, I'm going for it now. Here we go. Can y'all really feel me? Baby girl. East Coast. Feel me. 
Push it. Dirty South. Dirty, dirty. Can y'all really feel me? Feel it. East Coast. Feel they were. West Coast. Feel it. Uh -huh. Dirty South. Dirty, dirty, dirty. Can y'all really feel me? I got plenty of fucking East Coast. Feel it. You can get the biggest Chanel back in the store if you want it I gave them the drill, they sucked it up, I got them on it I bought a new paddock, I had to watch, so I two tone them Taking these drugs, I'm gonna be up until the morning That ain't your car, you just a listen, you don't own it If I'm in the club, I got that phone, I'm performing If I can't just came in and all corners Vibes get low, cute shit, they all on us I'm from Atlanta where your niggas run shit I know they hating on me, but I don't read comments Whenever I tell her to come, she coming Whenever it's smoke, we ain't burning Jook too hot, don't stand too close You gon' fuck around the time, off this way Doing all these shows, I've been on the road. I don't care why I go, as long as I keep paying. Bad little fire, she been on my mind. As soon as I get back, she can stay. Do this all the time, this ain't no surprise. Every other night, I'm the movie get made. Jump too hard, don't stand too close. You gon' fuck around and down. Off this way, doing all these shows, I've been on the road. I don't care why I go, as long as I keep paying. Bad little fire, she been on my mind. As soon as I get back, she can stay. Do this all the time, this ain't no surprise. Every other night, I'm the movie get made. Do this all the time, this ain't no surprise. Every other night another movie get made. Do this all the time. This ain't no surprise. Every other night another movie get made. Every other night another dollar get made. Every other night started with a good day. I feel like a child, I got boogers in the face. Everything's in the dollar, this shit is a parade. I don't want your train, I'm going out of slave. I had a job that too many bitches get insane. See that's how I'm working, so I took a private plane. You pussy nigga like it while I'm working on my aim. Drip too hard, too hard. Charge to the car, till it's down to the ground like a better spot in A. Drip too hard, caution on the floor. You gon' fuck around the joint, tryna ride a nigga away. Hot, don't stand too close, you gon' fuck around the town Off this way <laughs> I let my wig air dry last night. What, what's, what's happening? Baby, as stiff as the damn door now. You hear me? We're going we gonna to have to shake it going. We're going to have to shake it. Let's see. Come on. All right. That's what I'm talking about. Sometimes you just got to shake and go, baby. Shake that motherfucker. I'm sorry, mama. Excuse my language. Don't cuss like me, okay? All right. Don't get me wrong. It won't. Be long, I move it ain't my fault. Would you be mad at fire? Would you be mad at water? But long when in the space. Don't be mad at me when I you every day I'm just speaking me, boy Come on, period Period, okay It's a good day, ain't it? Uh-uh, hold on, hold on now Hold on Don't be like ah. I'm so like, girl, where my tap screen at? What the hell? Oh, she got lost Alright, let's listen to some music some music. What we what we smell on like today? I think I want to smell clean. When I girl, when I'm on my period, y'all, I know y'all can't see me, but when I'm on my period, girl, I want to smell as clean as possible. I don't want to smell like shit else. I may sometimes be want to smell sweet, but I don't be want to smell like anything else but clean. All right. 